This week from Crumble Cookies, Kevin and I are gonna be trying the brownie batter, old fashioned donut, cornbread, and look at the topping on that cornbread. Strawberry cake, and blue monster featuring Chips Ahoy. These cookies were provided to us free from Crumble, which we greatly appreciate. Crumble has been very nice to us. We will always give our true opinion, though. Uh, the first one we're going to try is the brownie batter, and it's so puffy looking. It is pretty thick. Yeah. I mean, that's a nice looking thick cookie. cookie. All, all of these truly are hefty looking cookies. Um, this is a chocolate cookie. It has semi-sweet chocolate chips. Ugh. Yeah, it looks really thick. Yeah, that looks nice. Yeah. That literally looks like a brownie, but in a cookie shape. Yeah. Truly. Yeah, got a chocolate chip that's really soft. That is incredible. Mm-hmm. I think that's the best tasting brownie cookie I've had from them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really, it's funny too, it's crispy on the outside. Like you go literally bite through like a crispy layer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really soft and cake-like almost on the, in the inside. Mm -hmm. Or brownie-like. That reminds me of the Ghirardelli mix that I'm always raving about. Mm -hmm. If you watch our other reviews, um, our favorite brownie mix from the store is Ghirardelli. That's what that reminds me of, it's mm -hmm. delicious. It's very good. Mm -hmm. Just the fact that you finished yours off. <laughs> exactly. Because normally you would have put the chocolate on the side. I do. Normally, um, <laughs> normally I do not finish the chocolate. That's mm -hmm. just the truth. I let Kevin finish what he wants of the chocolate. Um, that uh, it, it does absolutely remind me of that Ghirardelli mix. Mm -hmm. That brownie. It's very good. You know, like I said, I love the texture. It's kind of crispy on the outside, soft in the middle. It's yeah, similar. the the actual chocolate chips on the inside are are very soft, mm -hmm. and the whole thing, texture, flavor, it's a rich chocolate flavor. It's very, very good. But it doesn't taste um, artificial. It tastes like a really nice brownie. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I think you're awesome. gonna love that one. Yeah. Uh, the next one is old fashioned donut. So this is gonna have a ground, they use ground nutmeg. Oh. So we're gonna have a nutmeg flavor in this donut. And it has a vanilla glaze. Yeah, you can see the glaze on top. And once again, the texture on this looks so nice. Mm -hmm. Kevin said there was someone new working today. You really do taste that nutmeg in there, but it's not bad. It's not strong. It's not overpowering. It's not like, ugh, that's too much. You know, it's, not, it's nothing like that. That's, that tastes like a really classic old fashioned donut. Old donut. An yeah, old not donut. A, not an old donut. Tastes like an, an old, old fashioned donut. donut. <laughs> the old school donuts is what I was going to say. They even got the texture right. Mm -hmm. Kind of sugary on the outside mm -hmm. and a really soft cake like inside. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Okay. I have to say, mm -hmm. if you've ever had it before and it really, you didn't think it was your thing, it, it, we can only speak for our store. That's, that's the bad, the bad thing. Bad we can thing. Only, you know, every store is so different. That's the bad thing is we can only speak for our location. But if you had that old fashioned donut and it was not your thing before, you need to try this one because they've changed that. That is... Oh, the first is bacon is bacon different. <laughs> yeah, both of these. Both yeah. of these are... I'm telling you, they're better than what we've ever mm -hmm. had before. Yeah. I don't know what they've changed. Something has changed. That, the new person was not baking. He was prepared. Right. So. <laughs> but that that seems like a different recipe than what we've had in the past. Yeah. It, because those seem flatter. Mm -hmm. They didn't have a lot... More uh, dense. Yes, more dense. This is... Is truly like a donut. I mean, the glaze and everything, that 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 crispy texture on the outside, but it, it's nice on the inside, mm -hmm. and everything about that is perfection. Yeah, it's really, really. I good. love that. Yeah. I, I have no complaints about that no, at all. It's really, really. I mean, that's. That, I, I like the chocolate, but I like that one better. I know. I know. <laughs> it's so delicious. Yeah. Okay. Now this one, I can just tell you, the guy gave us more frosting than we should get. Wow. Because you could tell. Because he was scooping it up and she goes, just a little bit less than that. 
And so he kind of ranked, he's new. Yeah, he kind of ranked some off, but then she kind of went and did something else, and he's still sitting over there patting it out. I'm going, he's giving us a lot of frosting. So you're probably not going to get that much. <laughs> so thank, thank you, new you. guy. <laughs> thank you, new guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This is how I want it. <laughs> this is how we should get it. Yeah, yeah. this is how I want it because I'm. I'm I, that's just me. I give me more. Uh, I do have to say the cookie itself is kind of. It's really, really super thick, but it's not very big around. It's kind yeah. of small. Give me, give me more, give me more. Yeah, that was a song. Okay, cornbread. Cornbread cookie with honey butter glaze, honey butter cream frosting, and a honey drizzle. Here, no, oh, you want to give me this one? Sometimes you hand them to me. Sometimes you scoop things it over and you want are. me to pick it up. That's how nasty they I are. I never know. That's how dirty they are. This one's pretty sticky though. I'm trying just the cookie. No, I, I got a good, good hunk of just getting, no, oh, I had a good end. The cookie itself does have a cornbread flavor. It does not taste like a regular sugar cookie. No, it's more um, like, a corn, like a corn muffin kind of flavor. Yes, it, it would remind you of a Jiffy corn muffin. The mm -hmm. actual cookie tastes like that. It's sweet. So, yeah, so you are not getting just a regular sugar cookie. Mm -hmm. Now, we've had these before, and this one's, uh, it's very similar to what they had before, mm -hmm. but it's really good. I like that amount of frosting, by the way. You can't beat that. Yeah, it really sweetens it up. Yes, and then it it's does. got a drizzle of um, some kind of honey or syrup or something on it. Honey? There. Yeah. I think he, mm. did, he took his time doing this to it, too. So there's did plenty he? of drizzle on there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> No, I hope we get him again. Yeah, for real. No, by the end, by the time we get him again, he'll he'll have done it for a week, and yeah, he'll, he'll be like whatever. Yeah, um, I literally think it was his first day. Oh well, that yeah, I, I love the job he did. I like the amount he yeah, gave really us. Yeah. Um, it the the frosting really does sweeten it up though, mm -hmm. because it if you have it plain without that frosting. It will remind you of a Jiffy Corn Muffin, and I don't even know that it has the the sweetness, the sweetness of a Jiffy Corn yeah, Muffin. Yeah, the Jiffy Corn Muffins are sweeter, for sure. Yes. This has still got that same yellow cornmeal flavor. Mm -hmm. And you get a little bit of that texture. Yeah, it's got the gritty kind of texture. Yes, uh, but the whole the whole gr good part for me is the frosting. Yeah, when you eat it all together, what I would do if I got that, I would take spread it, it a little squish bit. it a little bit, I would spread too. it around. I would too. I would take a knife or like that big wide knife and kind of fork fall, or some anything flatten it out, out a little bit yeah. so that you get some uh, to the edge uh, especially if you get that much um i very much enjoy that mm -hmm. one too yeah, and the texture is nice too it's I've always liked their cornbread cookies though oh yeah it's like uh i think it's like, I like a fan meal. favorite i like yeah. cornmeal so i like that gritty kind of cornmeal -y flavor yeah yeah um the next one is strawberry cake. now do you want a little bit of cookie and then frosting or do you want me to flip it over and give you all frosting and cookie? I would like enough on the edge to be able to taste the cookie all by itself. Okay. No, let me give you this then. And I wore my strawberry, my blouse, with, it has the strawberries on and it. Your strawberry shortcake. Because, because we're having the strawberry cookie. Um, strawberry so this is a strawberry and vanilla cookie with strawberry cream cheese frosting and white chocolate curls. That's what I'm wondering. Are you actually going to be able to There's taste? There's something red in there. Taste strawberry in the cookie. Oh, I don't know about the cookie. The the cookie's nice. Yeah, I don't get strawberry though. But I don't get any strawberry at all. No, it almost. It tastes different than a sugar cookie though. Mm-hmm. It does. Well, honestly, it has the texture. It has the texture of that um, an, uh, that old-fashioned old peanut butter cookie. Mm. It's kind of that texture, but I mean, of course, it doesn't have any peanut butter in it at all. But it's a different texture than the sugar cookie, um, mm. and it doesn't have that flour flavor. Mm. So it's it is different tasting than the sugar cookie. But I do not taste strawberry in the cookie. No, I don't. Either. I mean, maybe it, it says it's supposed to have it, but I don't get it at all. Mm, no, it's all in that frosting. The frosting is really strong. Mm -hmm. And they're supposed to pipe this all around to the cookie. So you should get you should get a pretty good amount of frosting on it if they do it right. Mm. 
I like the strawberry flavor. It's a very uh, fresh strawberry flavor. Yes. Mm -hmm. And then you get that really sweet frosting. It's really nice. Yes, it's very fresh. Um, it's it's not candy. Hmm. It's not a candy strawberry Artificial. at all. Nope. No, it um, it's very pleasant. And but it, but it has so much sweetness too. So if you're one of these people that you really don't like strawberry because um, it's not sweet enough for you, then that's definitely sweet. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I like it. And all of these are are well baked. I mean, yeah, they're, they're not doing a good job. they're not like uh, they're not hard. They're uh -huh. not. They're crispy, they're, they're but some of them have had a crisp shell on them. Like shell. even the strawberry had a crispy kind of like shell. But on the, the top. inside, the middle is it's very all, soft. Is soft, so yeah. it's not gooey though. It's not goopy for you that don't like um, under baked cookies. These aren't like no. that. They're baked. They're just softer. Yeah. No, okay. Like the um, not dry. <laughs> no, they're not dry at all. Uh, this is Blue Monster oh, featuring like glued in place. <laughs> featuring Chips Ahoy. I usually just leave the Chips Ahoy cookie, just let you know. So this cookie actually has Chips Ahoy cookie pieces inside. Um, uh, blue vanilla frosting and a mini Chips Ahoy cookie on top. <coughs> this one's a thinner, when I was cutting it, it's a much denser cookie. Mm-hmm. I like the texture of the chips. Yeah, you definitely get the chocolate chips. Mm -hmm. They're not melty because this is a, kind of a cool cookie. Um, they're not melted, but they're they're soft. So mm -hmm. when you're biting through them, you get this softer texture. Mm -hmm. I think I noticed it more because the cookie itself is a little dense. Well, the cookie's cold. It's a cold cookie. Mm -hmm. But honestly, the cookie to me, mm -hmm. the cookie itself tastes like if you buy a roll of chocolate chip cookie dough and you just eat it straight out of the refrigerator, you just like slice it and yeah. eat it. That's what because that that it, it's like a chocolate ch chocolate chip. That's what it tastes like. It's not quite as buttery, but it does remind you of the. Oh rolls. yeah, very yeah. much. Um, yeah. I like I like that. I don't like that one that much. Um, I don't like it as much as other ones. That's my last place. That's my last place too. Yeah. Not it's not bad. It's, yeah, it's because it's different. It is cold. It mm -hmm. is denser. It is a lot like refrigerated cookie dough. Mm -hmm. I still think it's delicious. It's somebody, still good. somebody has to come in last place. This has been like. But surprisingly, even with the frosting on there, it's not as sweet as you would think it would. But be. it still is. Sweet. It's sweet. It's sweeter than a couple of the other ones, but it's not as sweet as you would think. Usually, when they put frosting on it, it's like over the top. It's this yes, is like but that. it's like a, it's like a chocolate chip cookie dough with a thin layer of yeah. vanilla frosting. It's yeah, maybe color they, blue, but it's just vanilla. Maybe frosting. if they stuck a thicker layer of frosting on there, it would have been. I think it's sweet enough. It, it's it's fine. Um, but I, I think hmm. for for the quality for our store, this has been like the best week I think that we've had from our store. The quality, the 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 bake on all of these, yeah, the really nice. uh, the textures they did an excellent job this week. They really did. Yeah, they were, they were um, really good. I'm very pleased. I hope that you all at your location, um, I hope it's... This is you, good. <laughs> yeah, I really do. Um, so this is going to oh, be... Even the new guy didn't show me the cookies in the box, so just let you know. Oh, they don't do that. We've given up on that. Um, <laughs> I was letting you know, just because he's new, evidently whoever trained him still didn't tell him to do that. So. Yeah, we, yeah we, we, we don't worry <laughs> we'll about that anymore. That. <laughs> we just, yeah, we just have gotten in a habit. You I check, check it. Call. Check it. Just check it. Um, which do you think is the least sweet? The least sweet, probably uh, the chocolate one. I'm gonna say the chocolate one too. Although, although the donut one's not as sweet either, but it is sweeter than the chocolate. It so. is the chocolate, the the brownie sweet in its own way. Yeah, it's just different. It's right, it's just sweet. a rich chocolate <laughs> sweet. Yeah. Yes, um, instead although, of like a sugar sweet. Right, and the uh, the cornbread one is not really what you'd call super sweet. It's no. the frosting that makes it yes, sweet. Yes, if you have the cookie by itself, you won't get a ton of sweetness yeah. from just the cookie. It's going to be from that frosting, but you're not going to get one without the frosting anyway. But see, I would I would put the chocolate one probably at the least sweet. And then I would put like the cornbread and that cookie, the chocolate chip one, I'd put those as about equal. 
Okay. Sweetness wise. Okay. I almost say I might give the chocolate chip just a little bit less because it didn't come across as very sweet to me. The chocolate chip I do not think is as sweet as the frosting on right. the cornbread. Yeah. yeah. So for me, I'm going to say the cornbread only because of the frosting. Yeah. Um, because, yeah, I really think that old fashioned donut was sweet, it was sweet. too. Yeah, it was sweet. So um, what? And the sweetest is the strawberry. This is a hard week because honestly, I I really do think they did a, such a job. Yeah, they're all really, really good. All but if you're going to go spend your four dollars, which one are you buy them? Gosh, and it's all a matter of what you like. Yeah, they it's get, personal. There's uh, yes, because there's something here for everyone. If you like strawberry, go for it because you're going to like that cookie. Uh, but if you like if you like cornbread, you're going to like that that cornbread cookie. The brownie is uh, exceptional. Mm -hmm. Um, gosh, if I only had money to buy one. It's hard. It's very hard. I'm probably... Oh. <sighs> I'm having a toss-up. I know, I'm having such a hard time. <laughs> um, okay. I'm going to go for the old-fashioned donut. That's it. That, I'm going to go for it. That's the one I'm going for, the old-fashioned donut. And my second place is going to be the brownie. That'd be mine, too. Really? Oh my gosh, that's so! Funny. I was. It was these three, like the strawberry and the brownie and the and the cookie. I was debating between those three, and yeah, I think the the, the donut was probably the best. Be not only because it's not it's not super super sweet. It's sweet enough, but it has just a really good flavor. I'm and telling you, the bake on this. This is. I hope. I, I do hope really that they have changed the recipe and this it's, isn't this is everybody. this isn't just a fluke for our location. Right. You all are gonna have to let me know because I'm telling you we've had it before. It and was it, it not was like flat. this. Yeah, it was very very flat. Yeah, yeah, it was yes, it was a different experience. Yep. This is different. This is genuinely like a donut. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, for this week that is my favorite. Yeah. The donut, then the chocolate, then the strawberry, then the cornbread, then the. I, I, I agree. I'm right. going to agree with you 100% this yep. week. So you'll have to let us know what your experience is. Let us know, do you think they changed that recipe? I think that's a different brownie one too. I really do. Well, they got that donut spot on because it does taste like a donut. Yes. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll have lots of pictures for you at the end. And thanks for watching.